Hey, what's up guys? So you really seem to like the last invention build I did um, a couple of videos back and it's where I made this plasma lighter glove. Um, so if you haven't seen the video, go check that out. Um, but yeah, I had a lot of fun making this. So I kind of wanted to do another one of those videos. And today we're going to be turning this electronic airsoft gun into a wrist mounted airsoft gun. So some of you guys may remember last summer I made an Iron Man suit. Uh, we can actually go ahead and turn it on. Pretty sure this still works. Hey, there we go. And um, on this suit, I ha actually have a wrist mounted airsoft gun right here. And um, I wanna see if I can do it just the wrist gun by itself. Cause uh, I don't think I covered it too much when I actually made the suit. So yeah, I think it's gonna be a fun project. It's actually a gravity fed hopper. So we've got some BBs right here. All right, so I just finished charging up the gun. Got a decent amount of ammo in there. When I try to shoot it, nothing comes out, see? This should hurt. This should really hurt, but nothing comes out. So yeah, let's go ahead and rip this thing open and see what we can do with it. So this actually just comes right on out. And look at it, it's already in its own little casing. So that's why I originally used this gun. So we got it all apart and we also got a wrist strap. The only problem, it's a really terrible color of beige. So we're gonna have to do something about this. All right, that's better. So what I've done, because this barrel is actually detachable, I've just added a little piece of plastic to the side and I'm gonna kind of attach it like this. Uh, I'm thinking just add a piece of plastic right here, attach the barrel like this, and then have the hopper kind of in this little section right here in this cutout. So I mounted it to the plastic and uh, if we go ahead and flip the switch, you can see it fires pretty well. So if we actually take a BB and drop it down into the chamber and it shot way over there. So I just cut out the hopper. Um, it's just a piece of PVC and uh, I kind of rounded around the edges a little bit to make it fit better and also when it's upside down like this, uh, the BBs will drain down into the barrel and fire. And I just need to connect this and mount it just like that. So the way I'm planning on loading the BBs um, is I have this band right here that I just flick off and this thing opens up right here. And I can just put BBs in and close it up and just slip this thing back on. And then yeah, that should work. So the plan to attach this is to use a little bit of wire, I think, that would be the easiest way. And just kind of mount this on and then mount the battery on the other side. All right, so we are just putting the finishing touches on this glove. As you can see, I've got it mounted. Uh, I just used the wire. Uh, it's kind of, it was kind of perfect actually. This little band here holds in the battery real nice. This was actually the original trigger switch. Um, I'm just gonna use it as kind of a kill switch. Um, and what I'm actually gonna do, I splice these wires right here. And I'm gonna put in this momentary push button switch right here. And this will be on the kind of like Spider-Man type thing. So I can just click it like that. There we go. It shoots. All right guys, so here's the finished product. Got some BBs right here. All right, so the way it fits on, just basically like a normal wrist brace, this part's in the front, um, so it just slips on your wrist like this. And then actually, the cool thing is, this band can actually go around the airsoft gun, and it actually helps hold the battery in too, because it just connects right here, that Velcro. And this strap can go and kind of tuck in right under here, 
for a little more support. And then finally this last band added a piece of Velcro on top right here. So uh, this Velcro just sticks right there and it actually hold, helps hold in the wires a little bit better. And yeah, we can go test it. So there you go guys, a wrist mounted electronic airsoft gun. I had a lot of fun making this project. Yeah, I'm definitely liking kind of these freeform builds. Uh, let me know in the comments if you guys want me to do more, if you have any cool ideas of stuff I can make. So yeah, like it, share it, all that good stuff. Click that subscribe button if you haven't already and you want to see some more cool videos. So that's about all I've got for today guys, so I'll catch you in the next one.